Hello everybody, it's JoJo, and I'm here to do a October Favorites of 2020. So, um, girl, October Favorites. So, um, girl, I have a lot of favorites, so we're getting into it. Girl, October's been an amazing month for favorites, so we're gonna get into everything. Okay, um, okay. I'm just make sure it's all copacetic. All right. So I'll start off with um, body care, then I'll go into makeup, TV shows, movies, the whole thing. Okay. Okay. So first things first, um, I've been loving two hand soaps. So this is the hand soap I'm currently using in the bathroom right now. This is Vampire Blood in last year's packaging. I, I like last year's packaging and Vampire Blood better this year, but I like... Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin, Perfect Pumpkin, Halloween packaging better than this year than last year. So, it's old berries, but I'll show the Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin in a second. But here, Vampire Bloods. So this is Red Berries, Night Blooming Jasmine, and Petrifying Plum. So, I love this one. This is so cute. The packaging is so cute. I love this. You're going to see a lot of Vampire Blood in this um, video. Because I've been using everything in Vampire Blood this month uh, for October. I've been loving uh, the scent. It's just very fruity, dark, sultry, fruity smell. It's really nice. <clears throat> Okay, so I might as well stick with the Vampire Blood theme. I've also been loving the candle. I've been burning this year's packaging. With the bats in the true forest, the creepy forest, really cute. So as you can see, I've been burning that one. So that is down. Um, yeah, um, I'm loving this. <clears throat> Couple more, bur few more burns and it'll be good to go and I'll be done with this one. And this candle's really good. I love the Vampire Blood candle, but I like Girl, I love another candle a little bit better, but this one is so good. And then I've also been loving the Vampire Blood um, pocket back. So this is this year's packaging. Yeah, I love Vampire Blood. I just love it. Okay. Now let's get into other scents. So um, I got Perfect Pumpkin. I love this year's packaging in Perfect Pumpkin. This is called Pumpkin Spooky Cinnamon Moonlight Vanilla. So Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin, I like it um, in body care and other forms. Home fragrance is not my favorite, but the hand soap I think is my favorite form out of Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin. It's the hand soap form. I love the hand soap form in Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin. It's like the best, it smells the best in the hand soap. Yeah, it's so good, so. I used up a full of this one, a full bottle of this one in the beginning of October. This is a new one that I'm gonna use up next year, but I already used up a whole one of this. Love it. And the Vampire Blood is the one I'm currently using, so as you can see, it's halfway done. Okay, oh, see, this is why I gotta keep tissues. Girl. So I gotta keep tissues, okay. Girl, all right. All right, so then the can another candle I've been loving, oh, girl, I burned a whole candle of this one already. This is a brand new one. This, is, was, this was the one in the Spooky Storytime videos. This was the one, and this was the candle I was burning in those videos. So this is Deep Dog Chocolate Fresh Steam Milk Mischievous Mini Marshmallows. This candle is so cute. I was hoping it was going to light up the room with stars and stuff. Like it was going to illuminate the room with the stars all around the candle. But it didn't. But it still was a really nice glow. I bought like four or five of these candles. They're so good. So yeah, this will be in the um, full empties because I used up a whole candle already of this one. This is just, this is a brand new one though. Ah, oh, it smells so good. Deep dog, it really smells like a cup of, like you're literally brewing a dark chocolate, hot chocolate. Like a hot, deep dark chocolate cup of hot chocolate. Like that's what it smells like, honestly, to a team. Okay. But then I've been loving um, the White Pumpkin and Chai Body Cream this month. This is Cinnamon Cider Spice Pumpkin and Vanilla Glaze. As you all know, this is the complete repackage of pumpkin picking. The only difference is, I would say this is a lot stronger. Like the notes, it's the same notes, it smells the same, but I would say that this is even sweeter and stronger this year than it was two years ago. Oh, I freaking love this smell. Oh, it's so good. I mean, it's really good. I love it in the cream. I like it a little more in the mist and shower gel, but the cream is nice. Oh my god, the cream is so nice. Then I've also been loving um, the Frosted Cranberry Shower Gel. So this is Snow Dusted Cranberry Juicy Peach Ripe Red Raspberry. So I did a review on this not too long ago. Really good stuff. Really, really good stuff. Uh, don't mind my nails. I gotta get them done, girl. Girl, I'm gonna get them done 
very soon. Very soon. I'm probably gonna get them done tomorrow or something. I need to get them done. Girl. Okay, so yeah. Gorgeous, 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 gorgeous scent. Love the Frosted Cranberry Body Care. That was new for this. It came out this month. And I got did the cream. That's that. <laughs> Anything else? That's it for body care and stuff. Okay, so I got one perfume, Midnight Fantasy by Britney Spears. I've been loving this all for long, especially in nighttime. It's a really nice night smell. It's nice for day too, but it's really nice for nighttime. It's just a deep dark. It's kind of a reminisce of Vampire Blood in the in the actual fact that it's deep dark and mysterious and sultry type of smell. It's a different smell, but it's just in that realm of deep dark forbidden fruits. You know what I mean? So that is the Midnight Fantasy, and I love that one. That's like my. This has been like my fifth bottle. <laughs> I love that perfume. Okay, now on to makeup. First one is Witch Bitch in the Manny MUA Luna Beauty um, lipstick. This came out last year on his Moon Spa Halloween collection. Um, I love this color. This color is gorgeous. I mean, I'll swat. I would swatch it, but like, you guys know what it is. I've swatched it before on this channel. It's deep dark red, not as dark as Unicorn Blood, a little lighter, but it's still really nice red. Love the packaging, so I've been loving that lipstick. Um, yes, been loving that. Um, Okay, and of course, I'm going to say what I have on my lips, but first I'm just going to do um, the Velvet Trap lipsticks. These are definitely a favorite this month. This was a brand new boat lipstick formula that came out this this month from Jeffree Star Cosmetics. I have the shade Celebrity Skin, Unicorn Blood, Nudist Colony, and the Perfect Red. So the Nudist Colony and the Perfect Red are the two brand new ones that I got, and then Unicorn Blood and Celebrity Skin are two repeat shades. The one I have on my lips now is, um, Nudist, that's you know, called Blood, excuse me. This should be, yeah, Nudist Colony. So this is the one I have on my lips now. This is a pink, um, really pretty pink shade. I have it lined with, um, Christmas Cookie Lip Liner from Jeffree Star. So this is the Christmas Cookie Lip Liner. Lined with the Nudist Colony Velvet Trap Lipstick. And then I have, um, and this will also be in a favorites for this month, I have the Heaven's Gate Lip Gloss from Jeffree Star. So this is my lip combo today. I love this. I line my lips with Christmas cookie, put this in the center, and then gloss on top. It is the perfect, perfect new glossy lip. And I love it. I love it, love it, love it. It's such a pretty lip. So yeah, that's what I have on my lips today. Okay, so yeah, the Velvet Trap is definitely favorite for October. Love these shades. I wore Unicorn Blood in my last few videos. And today I'm writing News Colony. It's just the great lipsticks. Definitely a favorite, yes. Also been loving and I have it on my eyes now is the Blood Sugar Palette by Jeffree Star, of course. Of course, I have it on my lids now, as you can see. Um, hold on. The shades I have are Ouch, Coma, Cherry Soda, Tongue Pop, and Sweetener. So. The powder. Love this palette. It's such... Oh, this has been so many favorites. I love it. But I love um, that type of palette for the full season. What else? Um, I'm gonna say that's it for makeup. Right, yeah, that's it for makeup. So, oh, well, you know what, no. I'm gonna say this one too. I've been loving this one for um, the month of October. This is the shade Leo from Jeffree Star Liquid Lip. This is, um, what's it called? This is from his mini nude bundle. This one I will swatch, because I feel like this one, um, I, I, I had on my lips in one video, but like, I like I should swatch this one because I really don't talk about this one a lot on the channel. So this is Leo, Liquid Lipstick from Jeffree Star. It's a nude, brownish, dark brown nude. It's a really cute full um, nude. Love that shade. Yes. Okay. Okay, so that's it for um, makeup. Okay, so now let's go on to TV shows and movies. So... Um, I'll start with movies. So I've been loving all the Halloween movies, Hocus Pocus, Halloween, all the slasher films, 
um, Halloween Town, all the Halloween Towns. I've been loving them all. Um, Child's Play, Scream, Jeepers Creepers, Insidious, all the creepy um, movies. Love them all. Um, what else? Any new movies? I just saw Before I Wake, um, that which is a Netflix movie. It's really good. It's about this guy. When he sleeps, he dreams. Whatever he dreams um, comes to life in real life. But whatever he has a nightmare, that also comes true. So it's a really, really good movie. Um, also love the movie Eli, that's on Netflix, which is about this kid who has a special disease and he goes to a special hospital to get better, to get treated. They're all scary movies. Um, what other movie did I see? Um, that's it for movies, right? There really was no other movie. Yeah. Okay, now TV shows. So, um, I've been watching The Weakest Link with Jane, Lind, Lind, I forgot what her name is, but um, she was on Glee. I really like her. Um, she's the new host on The Weakest Link. I love that game show. I remember watching it back in the day with that Swedish woman. You know what I mean? I love that. Anyways, uh, so I love this the, the, the Weakest Link. Dancing with the Stars has been amazing. I love, I really do like this season. Uh, my favorites this season are definitely um, Johnny Weir. Of course, um, I would say the Spanish woman actress, the Spanish actress, I like her. Um, who else do I like this season? Um, there's so many. I mean, there's just so many to choose from. I like um, the girl from Days of Our Lives. So I watched Days of Our Lives. I like Days of Our Lives. I do remember her. She She's an actress. Um, the Backstreet Boy is okay. Um, you know, there's a few. They're, they're, they're good ones this season. I did like them. You know, like a lot of... I don't forget who went home last. I think it was the football player. It was, it's a good season so far. I do like it. Um, what other TV shows? Okay, so The Real Housewives of Potomac has been really, really, really good. Um, I'm definitely team Candace when it comes to Candace versus Monique because I think I already said that in my last video, my last favorites, but um, I do love the season. Like, I love Potomac. Potomac is, like, one of my favorites. It really is. And then, um, what else? Um, The Masked Singer, new season. So far, everyone that's became unmasked, I did not know. I have not known. But, um, you know, it's still earlier on in the season, so um, there's a lot more people that's got to get unmasked. The Voice so far has been good. There's only been a couple episodes, but um, The Voice has been good so far. Of course, they're doing the, um, they're, they're, they're doing the same thing, like, the, the, they're there in person. The only difference is the audience is not there. It's just like, um, it's like a fake studio audience, you know what I mean? Same thing with Dancing with the Stars and The Masked Singer, it's the same thing, it's just a fake audience. But it's the same, like, the judges, everyone's still there live in person. Um, what else? What other TV shows? That's really it. I mean, there really was no other TV shows per se. I mean, I'm trying to go down like the list in my head, but like there really is not many. Like, yeah, I mean, that's it for TV shows. Yeah. And I said movies, TV shows, and that's that. So, yeah, I mean, and then the other favorites have been the debate. I'm loving the debate, um, the debates, you know, with the Joe and Trump. Um, go Joe, dumb Trump, that's my motto. <laughs> um, Joe's been really, really good. I've been loving the debates, even though Trump talks over Joe. But um, Joe has been standing his ground and able to speak. And especially the last debate, he was able to speak and finally um, talk on his side of everything. Because um, the first debate, he was not allowed to do that because Trump was talking over him the entire time. Um, so yeah, I mean, that's really that, um, any other October favorites? Like, I'm trying to think, like, anything else that I've been, like, loving this month. Um, that's really it. I mean, we'll see next month for November if Joe wins. We'll see. We'll see. It's coming up very soon. Very, very soon. So yeah, this is my last video I'm going to film today. Um, I filmed a lot of videos today. I know I'm wearing a different top. Um, but I filmed a lot of videos today. I filmed, um, Sam Reviews, I filmed the Velvet Trap Lipsticks. It was all on the same day, but I'm going to upload them throughout the week. Um, I filmed a lot of videos. This one will be uploaded last, obviously. This is probably be uploaded, what, the end of the week, like, maybe October 30th. 
Um, yeah. And I might do a Halloween mood bang, but I'm not entirely sure yet, but I might do a Halloween mood bang. Um, which would be consist of, like, me eating candy and, like, Halloween cupcakes and stuff like that, you know? Um, so yeah. Yeah, I've been loving the month of October with all my stuff. I, like, a lot of great stuff came out this month. Ready for the holiday season. I did a lot of online orders um, for Bath & Body Works, so stay tuned for a lot of hauls. Yeah. That's that. All right. I love you guys. Hope you guys enjoyed the October favorites of 2020. <clears throat> um, let me know what you've been loving this month from makeup, body care, beauty, TV shows, movies, whatever. Sky's the limit. Comment down below. Let me know. Okay. Love you guys. Have a good one. And um, bye.